got uh, a booster and now it has uh, implants. And this is basically the same. This is the idea of the lecture. If you're new to it, this is just the basic thing. A brief introduction for myself. I am a professor in the College of uh, Dentistry, the University of Baghdad. And it's quite an old university. It's, uh, the college has been around for about 70 years. We have about 1,200 undergraduate students uh, and around 300 uh, postgraduate students. I also have a private practice, which has been there for 25 years. And uh, the, uh, I have a large team and we're exclusive to orthodontics. I'm also the president of the Iraqi Orthodontic Society for the past three years, and we have some scientific events going on. And lastly, I'd like to tell you that I have uh, under my name a YouTube channel with a, about 7,000 subscribers, and I've got a lot of uh, orthodontic teaching videos. Some of them are mine, some of them are kind contributions from others. And I've made them as playlists, as bracket prescription, orthodontic biomechanics, etc. And you'll find this lecture also being posted on the same website if you wanted to see it later. You can go to WebEx, uh, also a new uh, website on YouTube. They'll also post it there. And I hope to receive any questions in the comments and I'd be happy to answer them. Now, starting with the topic of the day. The expansion is the uh, uh, expansion. Why, why do we do expansion? We generally do expansion because we're correcting cross bites, but sometimes we do it to create space or to prepare people for my functional appliance treatment or pre-surgical treatment or just for the fashion of widening smiles.